Hey, what's up everybody? StarCraft8824 here. Alright, so... Today I am going to talk about... What types of food you can feed your turtle, because I'm getting asked this a lot. And I think it's time to make a video on it. Alright, so... As you can see, turtle sticks. Most of you think... Turtle sticks, that's all I need. And they are good to go. Well, if you are one of them, you're wrong. Turtle sticks is kind of like you just eating meat your rest your whole life. Yeah, you'll live on it, but you're going to be unhealthy, and it's going to end your life short. So, feeding your turtles just turtle sticks the whole time is going to shorten their lifespan, and you'll probably see that they get fat. So, let's start by talking about the common ones, most common ones, Wardley, Reptile Sticks, Reptomin, the two most common ones. Alright, and I'm going to add in a third one that probably maybe some of you have heard of. This is Missouri Turtle Food. Uh, reason I don't have the container because it's a 25 pound bag. So, which is better is one better? Really is the question. Yes. Nutrition wise, this is, comes in third place. Reptomin comes in second place. And this one, the Missouri Turtle Food, would come in first place. Alright, so you're wondering why if this Missouri Turtle Food is so great you never heard of it? Well, the easy answer is look. You can only buy Missouri Turtle Food in bulk size. So, unless you're insane like me, and have over 20 turtles, you definitely can't buy that, because you will never use that amount of food in your turtle's lifetime if you have one or two. Because, believe it or not, turtle food has a shelf life of like two years, I, I believe it is, so you got to use it up. Now, of course, I can't even use that much, so if anybody wants me, uh, I can sell this for smaller quantities because the smallest you can buy it on the internet is one pound and it's like ten bucks plus shipping. I'll sell mine. If you want a pound, I'll give it for five dollars plus whatever shipping. Uh... And we'll sell that later down the week to a couple other people first. I gotta get rid of like five pounds because I'll never use it up either. Alright, so... That's all I have to... Oh, no, no. Alright, so... Gotta say something about the Missouri turtle food. It's a really hard pellet. It, baby turtles have a really hard time eating this. It ain't like the sticks that turn soft in a matter of minutes. So if you buy it for baby turtles, you gotta soak it in the water for a little bit before they can even eat it. So, another thing. Alright. Well, how much should you feed your turtle? Well, we're gonna say as much as it wants. That's what I do. I know you probably heard the rule, uh, feed it uh, the amount of its head per day. Uh, once per day, I throw in as much as they can eat up until they're three inches. That's when we get into the other types of food, but pretty much baby turtles, I feed the sticks, throw in some worms, some crickets, insects, whatever. And that's pretty much the baby turtle diet, so... There you have it. Alright, so we will move on to the vegetables.